rod, some people crack their own necks and back. What is that about? Oh, so in some ways it seems to be a fashion thing. You see soccer players cracking things. But, but if, if you're cracking your back or your neck because it feels better, then you have a problem. You've, you've got an old injury problem. And that's a really serious thing because you're actually making it worse. So you imagine again with a spine, all these different joints. And if you have some joints that decide they just don't want to move in certain directions for whatever reason, probably old injury, then other, other joints will move more for them and you won't have any idea that that's happening. So you've got areas that are too tight, areas that are too loose. And if that whole thing starts to feel really messed up and you can crack something and it takes the tension out so it feels better, you'll only ever move the things that are too loose. You'll never move the things that are too tight. So you give yourself short-term relief, but you reinforce the, the, the problem. And if you crack your back once a day, after a while it'll be a couple of times a day and it'll end up being about every 20 minutes because that's about the limit. 20 minutes is the shortest time it takes for that whole cracking system to regenerate. So if you're cracking your back or your neck to feel better, you really need to see someone who's good at evaluating what's going on and, and have it corrected because it's not going to happen by itself. Yeah. That's, chiropractors are good at that.